Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be modding my EV800 goggles by adding the Eosheen Pro DVR to them. So I'll have some uh, recording functionality. I'm going to be using just one cable here. It's the six pin connector that goes to the side of the DVR. And uh, there's six cables here. There's audio in and ground. Uh, the two middle ones are video in and ground, and we have uh, 5 volts and uh, ground here. So I'm going to be taking apart uh, the goggles and looking for the appropriate uh, spots to connect up and solder on these wires for uh, the receiver. Just have to take off these four screws to get inside. Top just comes off like that. It's pretty easy. And we're going to. Uh, I'm going to leave the battery connected because I need to power this up to find out where the power is. Getting the uh, battery out is a bit of a challenge. Okay, go ahead and power this on. I'm just going to use a multimeter to find out where the power is and uh, what the voltage is. It's probably over here on the right. Okay guys, so I think on the receiver, the far right one is ground, uh, the second to the right is video out, and I believe the third is going to be audio out. I'm um, not 100% sure, but I'm going to go ahead and solder my, my wires here, as if that were the case. Now, this DVR needs 5 volts, but this is a 1S battery. So you need a uh, step-up regulator here, so this will step up the 1S voltage to 5 volts, which I'll then connect to the DVR using this cable. Be right back. Okay guys, so I got all the wires soldered in, and let me go over what I did. I uh, ran the connector. I ran the connector here um, through this little hole where the LED um, clear plastic was, and I just popped that out. So I just wanted to reuse that hole. And the wires come through here. Then I have the um, 5 volts in power going to the regulator here. The It's the step up regulator. So it's taking uh, voltage from here where the receiver goes in. Positive, that's, I believe that's battery voltage. I, I measured a multimeter and it was the same as the uh, 1S LiPo. And then I uh, had all the grounds going to the very far right pin. The second to far right is the video, and the white is the audio, which is the third to the right. And that's all the wiring you got to do. And I'm just going to put this all together and um, see how the recordings look. Oh, I forgot to mention, I think some of you are going to probably ask and wonder why I decided to solder my power over here instead of over here. I actually tried it over here, but then I realized that the regulator will be constantly on because it's connected directly to the battery and there's a power button right here that I can just turn on and uh, they won't supply any power until I actually power it onto the button here and as you can see as well the um, if there's power going to the regulator it's going to be turning on the DVR and draining the battery uh, while it's sitting idle which I don't want but as you can see now the battery is connected and the uh, DVR is powered off I go ahead and power on everything here then you see now the DVR is on so that's the reason why I did that because uh, when you press the power button it actually turns on the the power to the receiver and that's where I tapped in for the power and then I'll go ahead and turn it off there you go okay so here it is all 
uh, stuffed back in here. It's a little fiddly getting it all to fit. Um, and there's the regulator. Um, I'm about to close it up, so I just wanted to give you guys a last look at this before I close it up. Okay, hey guys, so I finished the install, and here it is uh, sitting on top of my EV800 goggles. Overall, it's a pretty clean build. Not a whole lot to it. Just sits on top of here with some double-sided foam tape. Now, I did make one change to the uh, regulator in here because uh, the one that I was using was causing some video noise. And uh, I'll show you, I took it out. It's this one right here. And uh, instead I used this one. It's a Pololu uh, Step Up, this uh, S7 V7 F5. I believe these are about five or six dollars. And I got this one for like 50 cents. So, um, and of course this one's a lot smaller. Uh, so I think the quality of the voltage regulator is gonna make a difference in terms of the uh, video that you're gonna see on the screen itself and also in the recordings. And I'm not sure if that's because of the voltage regulator or if, if it's because the DVR is very noisy electrically, um, but using the, the Pololo, which has a better filtering, uh, fix that problem and the video is fine now. So anyway, I hope you guys liked this video. Um, if you have any questions about how to do this mod, please let me know in the comments below. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video.